What's going on guys, it's your boy Boo here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to add Steam, like non-Steam games to Steam. So, what I have to do is I'm just going to be showing you guys how it works first, and then closer to the end of the video, I will show you how to do it. So first, let's just get Minecraft. You can do Minecraft League of Legends, just to prove it. I'm going to go to the market and search Minecraft. See, Minecraft, like the actual game doesn't come up. Or League of Legends. In a game you guys probably don't know, RC Final. There, okay. Oh. Okay, I just proved that that's not on Steam. Um, so then, yeah, I just proved them not on Steam. So now let's go on, for example, I did Roblox Player, but we're not going to use that. So if I go on, let's see, it's fine. Okay, okay back there, there it is. So if you click play, it's just going to run like normal. I'm just going to go here. I'm actually gonna run. Actually, I'll run the game just to show you guys that it still works. Okay, boom, and it says in a non-Steam game, Minecraft. So some people do this. They get a folder or something. They name it um, trading, and then they they do it with the trading, and then like what's it called? Uh, so they add it to the library, and they just click AFK leave and just leave that on. So then people will think like so people will know that they're actually like playing pretty pretty much like like no like no they're trading. So I'm just gonna on the server. I don't know why I'm lagging, but I'm just gonna do this video quickly. So then, if you like this, shift tab, it will show this. You will get this menu that Steam Games have, and then this proves it works perfectly. So everything works here. Texture packs work. I just closed it because I have some secret texture packs, you know. Okay. So then that works. Prove that. So then now that it won't show an, like icon here. That's pretty dumb, is my opinion, but it it works. Okay. So then. Yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna show you guys that icons work. So icon is there. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how to now add it. So you go to add a non Steam game. All your crap shows up. So then there you go, like we'll do let's see. We can put well, I don't know, there's no games I really want right now to add. But I'll just show you an example because I'll delete it after, so we'll do Skype. No, with the scrolls. Okay, so you just click this, click this. It's really easy. Find the game. Um, and then you can't do it if it's already added, unless you delete it, I'm pretty sure. You can click Add Selected Program. So click it, and then it has been added. So let me just find it. If I just search Rune, you can probably find it. I don't have a game called Rune. So what was it then? No, okay. Okay, give me a second, guys. I don't even know what I put in. Scrolls, yeah, that's what I put in. Okay. And then if you delete it, see, you just go delete shortcut, and it's gone. And yeah, it's still there, as you can see. It's still there. Uh, if it was there, if I had it on my desktop. But then, as you can see, that works. It's pretty cool if you guys want to add some cool stuff. And you guys, you can text, you can like uh, message me the cool stuff that you've done. So, hope you guys have enjoyed and the video leave a like if you did and if this has helped you if you need any more how to videos just comment down below and i'll teach you guys hope you guys enjoyed see you guys in the next video